Hello, friends. Sorry, I felt like being weird. Uh, first pro clear of the session. Let's fucking go. Ruin the fucking sound again. So I noticed that the game audio is quite low in a lot of these and I keep going up and down so I'm trying to raise the game audio and just raise my voice so that both are audible because yeah yeah that makes a sound on the uh goes into the yellow there. Oh Sparks' legs. No, he was cute before but now look at that. Oh, too many legs. Get rid of it. Kill myself. Bugs. Your game camera is in passive mode. Oh, you tried to trick me. Last time that was Hunter's job, but at least he had the dignity to be on that side. Still can't do this, right? Huh. Maybe if I... Narp. Narp? So this is ready now. They pulled the balloon down, which... That was anchoring it. But, uh... Yeah, let's go to World 2. Oh, wait. We didn't do one thing. Do you remember this guy's world? We're just gonna go quickly and do Sheila's uh, area for that. Because I'm actually, like, I wouldn't normally, if this was just a mini game challenge, right, so that it works. Like, the system works. That's, that's just, oh, and we didn't do this. Ah, <sighs> fucking speedways. Right, we're gonna go do Sunny Villa because. That's not Sunny Villa. Because, um, yeah, I'm just going to run through and do Sheila's bit because, yeah, new character equals new interesting content a lot of the time, and I like playing a Sheila, whereas before it felt a bit, like, frustrating to play a Sheila, so they're, they're doing their job, as in, like, I wasn't on screen going back and doing orb challenges because they're not, bo they're not very interesting. Yeah, you're a dragon. Oh, it doesn't even matter. So let's just run through. See, the weird thing is now is they don't drop anything at all when you kill them. Like, Uh, whereas in Spyro 1 they drop these little pieces, these... And in Spyro 2 they always drop their soul energy, and now it's like you get the gem from them and you just murder them, and it's now like... So now we're saying Rhinox don't have souls, but Norx and other environment hazards do? That's a weird phrase. Hey Spyro, there are Rhinox everywhere. Maybe I can find some peace and quiet at the top of this tower. Thanks for telling me that. Alas, I have lost my love. She's being guarded by evil Rhinox at the top of yonder tower. Can you rescue her for me? Why do they have to be like that, man? Get wrecked. <laughs> Kill a frog. <laughs> Oh, I got a life for murdering another. Life for a life. Your soul is mine. <laughs> you own. Imagine being killed and you only drop one gem. <laughs> like, you know, people got killed and then their value was turned into a gem, and that popped out of their corpse, and you just, you just get a single gem. <laughs> Oh, fuck me, that is so depressing. Who would even, how would you even judge that, like... Okay, so where am I going? Oh no, platforming. In a platformer. 
Oh no. Way simpler platforming. I'm just blind. I don't actually remember this one at all. Basket is more valued than this Rhinoc. That's depressing if you're the Rhinoc, right? I kill a wicker basket and get two gems. <laughs> I take a life and get one. Is Spyro trying to tell us something about the concept of souls? Oh, I can go there though. Dead. Dead. C -c -c combo. Oh, choice. Split pathing. Fuck. There are many split paths. Ah. Uh. Oh, that's just where I was. I just missed a gem because I'm an idiot. I really need to stop disparaging myself for like a meaningless gem grab. Sorry everyone, I'm getting distracted by shiny things. I saw another shiny thing over there as well. Oh, I didn't pick him up. So before it would take a long time for that kick to come out and I used to get wrecked a lot because you can see I'm reacting very slowly to things. That so they're coming up towards me and our models are chafing together and that's when I kick them. So they made it easier in that sense. More forgiving box hitboxes and uh, wind up time of enemy attacks and your active frames are better, so. Oh, let's go get this one. Just clear it out proper. I know I'll come back anyway, so this is actually pretty pointless, but whatever. actually very little forward momentum when she jumps so if you just hulk jump everywhere it's actually not got enough momentum to be like a good traversal object you actually have to stop and walk a bit so it's a little bit like I want to be able to just sprawling across the map and it not take triple the time but you know can't have everything can you probably like the game didn't want me to do that so ah there we go Yesterday I had a massive panic attack because I left this on when I went to the shops for... Oh, I was picking some up some stuff I ordered online from the depository, the, the mail packaging. Y you know, like the things in Death Stranding, where all the mail goes to get sorted. What? Oh, she's a girl, so she has to be pink. Oh. I don't like that camera fixed camera thing. Well, and you can do that's actually kind of disconcerting. Did I just fall through here? I can. Got a restraining order. I mean, that's a bit of a weird thing to put. Okay, I don't really care. Uh, fine. You know, fine. I've seen weirder. Did I go up here? Let's go up here. I feel like I didn't go up here. Uh, there we go. Yeah, we didn't. Ah, oh, there we go. And that precludes me having to go around checking now. 
yeah, I had a bit of a like nervous breakdown that I'd lost all of this content because uh, I, it's a new build and the, even the landlord doesn't know what he's doing for this place, which is, oh, I was still thought I was Sheila for some reason, why would I be? Uh, I was like, I'm going to spring over there and it's like, wait, why am I purple? Oh yeah, Durgan. So we're just going to speed run to the end now. We've done all this, it's 100 percent now, I think. Oh, we didn't do Hunter's sick, radical, lizard skating number two, the squeak wall. You want to go do that? Anyone want to see that? I mean, then we've 100%ed a level on screen, right? Just gonna quickly. It'll be fine, I wasn't having trouble too much. Oh. Yeah, no. Timed and I can't fuck up now, okay fine. <laughs> Maybe later. Sorry, wasting everyone's time here. Uh, I really need to invest in a decent mic. Uh, yeah, so even, because it's a new build, this guy purchased it to rent. And I'm the first renter ever. It's like a brand new build, which is really nice, but like at the same time, he doesn't know how to pay utilities. I've only been in the house for two days, and they just switched off all my electricity, and I was like, and I was hearing drills in other places, so I thought, maybe it's maintenance. So I text him, and I text the uh, estate agent saying, what happened? And they were like, we don't know. And I'm like, well, it'd be nice if I knew. <laughs> You know? And they were like, oh, okay, we'll call up the people. Oh, you didn't pay your bill. And I'm like, I've been here two days. Oh, why did I go here? No, 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 no. This is the wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. Oh! Stupid tornado. Uh, let's, let's just go to the... And I was talking to the landlord, and he was like, so they're saying that you didn't pay your bill. And I'm like, wait, what bill? How do I pay the bill? As we just sorted this out, he said, I put 50 quai on your thing. And I was like, okay, 50 RMB on the uh, thing. I was like, okay, that should definitely cover me for the next month, because electricity is super cheap here, for better or for worse. Because, um, you know, people got, like, their houses, and some people here don't get paid any money at all, so... Uh, yeah. Let's just go. So yeah, they are named after times of day and night, so that's interesting. Oh, shit. Of course. They, you know, I said I thought there was a boss called Scorch. I looked at the achievements for this, and there's a boss here called Scorch. So that's why I was like, hey, isn't Scorch a character slash boss? This chick needs like a tribunal. Aren't you a dragon? Boss talk to me like this. I tell him to fuck off and leave on the spot. <laughs> is it me? Oh, so the Rhinox are also just like nice, kind of peaceful creatures that she's bullying. <laughs> That's why I like Sergeant Bird so much, he's so cool. I don't remember Sergeant Bird having such a blatant British accent where he's like, oh yes, tally-ho, but like, at the same time, I don't really remember much about him other than he's a flying penguin with rocket launchers. When I heard the sorceress was planning to ambush you, I got here as fast as I could. No worries, though. This pussy green toad will be no match for the two of us. Yeah, this pussy green toad. 
<laughs> no. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. So what are we doing? What are we doing? Uh. Uh. Help me, mate. Help me. Oh. Oh, okay. I'll just fuck this then. Oh, I see. You think you, you think you're you think you're cute, bitch. I'm adorable. I'm gonna wreck your shit. Oh, oh. He's got tech. Look at this sumo shit. Kind of annoying that you think about how Ripto's bosses, Ripto's Rage's bosses, are introduced real early, and here they're just literally like, oh, just uh, fire out a boss, stop him. Oh, it's shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, kill him. Yeah. He's drowning in lava and you slightly stomped on him. Now what? Oh, okay, you just... I'm on the sheep. The ship. No, no! Yeah, yeah, we can do this. There's a, there are these towers in the background and they're really distracting. Is that my spawn point? Yeah, it's my spawn point. I don't need to take this from you. I'm gonna do things my way. It's my way. My way or the highway. Oh! Fred just would not stand for this. Fuck you. I'm gonna do things my way. My way. No! Oh. Oh. Dodging and weaving. Go left. Oh yeah. He didn't know what to do once you trapped him by slightly turning left during it. Oh now he rolling. Oh I'm trying to get sheep and I just lose more health doing that. Oh Oh, he, oh okay, you got some defensive tech. No, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, shit. Stop bouncing, sheep. I need you. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you little fuckwit. <laughs> oh. Why did I keep chasing him? You cannot pursue this man. He's like Lu Bu. I'm just memeing it up over here. I don't even give a shit. I know what you want. Oh, to the right. All your limbs in a box to the right. Yeah. Oh, 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 we're doing this. We do this. We do it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this is, this is pretty crazy. Oh, but it's not as crazy as like, I mean, it's pretty simple. It's, oh, you roll in them. Smug fuck. No, you're going in. You go in. We go now. You go now. Yeah. Yeah. So like I was saying about, uh, oh shit. Like I was saying about the, the oh, oh, he's rolling around. At the speed of sound. <laughs> Uh oh, oh you little shit. He's gonna do even more intense shit, yeah. Where are my sheeps at anyway?
Oh, okay. I thought that was like tech. Shit. So yeah, like I was just surprised because I would assume that, that if you own the property, you would know <laughs> like all of this stuff from the get-go. Like they'd say, here the keys to your property. Here's how you pay the bills. And the dude was literally like less prepared than I was. And I was like, what do you mean you don't know how to pay the bills? <laughs> and I was having to ask the other people and like he was like, oh, beats me, man. But then he worked it out and was like paying for it and then I paid for two months this morning but I was just sat there like, seriously, I hate this shit, this is such a China thing. Multiple houses I've been in, I've been like, so can I pay the, the utility bills? Hello? And they've been like, what? And I've been like, yeah, utility bills. And they're like, oh, don't worry about it. And my electric gets turned off and I'm like, pretty sure I should be worrying about it, <laughs> you know? feel like it's something I need to pay for and um, the electric company are pretty pissed because I haven't paid it for six months straight but here it was like two days no shit's given I said to him I'll pay for like I'll pay for like uh oh I'll pay for like uh six months in advance I don't give a shit I can pay that and they were just like nah you can pay 300 and I'm like how much is 300 two months and I'm like so I, I'm going to forget, and then I'm going to get my sh electric shut off again. So annoying. That's until December, so I'll be here at Christmas with no lights on. <laughs> oh, bah. Making this harder for myself by knocking him back in. Jumping to the right now. That's his thing. Mm -hmm. I forgot he did this bit. Oh! At least while he's doing that, I can just go farm. <laughs> oh, I know what to do. I'll get him to charge. Come to me. <laughs> I'm making life way too hard for myself by butting him repeatedly. No, no, no! a small sacrifice. Oh! Good job I got that. Ah. That didn't save you, though. In fact, that tech was weaker than your defensive shit. Uh... <laughs> is it small turning circle, or is it, like, what, what do you want from me? Dead. Put your thumbs up like it's Terminator 2. Oh, damn it. Bye, Grayson. <laughs> I wanted to sheep. Alright. So that's that area. Oh, man. And lots of big changes recently with me and my friends. It's pretty cool. Uh, one of my friends told me that his wife is pregnant. Gonna go ahead and assume it's his baby. <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, I'm just being weird. Um, yeah, they've been together five years, so I thought, you know, they're very like... I don't know, I felt like that was coming. 
And I was like, oh, yeah, you know, because, like, the moment they got married, everyone was like, yeah, it's going to be a baby soon. I don't know why. They just feel like that kind of group of people, you know? Like, they're really, really, like, that's their thing. Family is their thing. Ooh. What now, Bianca? You weren't even planning to kill me a cutscene ago. Ass bunnies. Good job they're not cute. Does he feel bad? So this is a nice environment that I've almost totally forgotten. So it's gonna have a little explore. Oh, icy peak. There's was something saying about like a Spyro 2 level where I was like, why didn't they just call it icy peak? Or snow capped peak that was for the Himalayan themed one where they called it something like Colossus instead. And it just felt like, why isn't this called Icy Peak? Perhaps they were saving it for this one. For a level. Ooh. Mingus! Bye, Mingus. <laughs> Cancelled. Yeah, so my friend's got an. Uh, uh, his, my friend and his wife are pregnant. I mean, his wife's my friend as well, I assume. <laughs> but like, uh, you know, they're pregnant. Ooh, good for them. Ooh, Dave. Why is Dave underwater? Bye, Dave. <laughs> and I was just like, oh, that's really good for them. And then immediately your brain starts thinking a certain route. Of, wow, all these people are like society pressuring you to be married and have children by a set age even though there's absolutely no reason and you don't even want that and you're sat there like really it's not about me i'm just happy for them <laughs> but i was thinking to myself today it's kind of funny how certain people have progressed in this fashion oh oh i nearly had him Oh, 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 dead, by Trixie, they're just giving me eggs, yeah, and like, there's a high pressure in China as well, even if you're a foreigner, they're just sat there like, where are you married, where do you have kids, and it's just like, because I don't want to do that, so, you know, they, my friends haven't given me any pressure at all. They're just like, oh yeah, you know, I'm, I got, we get, we got this kid coming, and I'm like, oh cool, good for you. Oh, I got to save the penguin. We just clear this out first, so I have enough gems. I think I have enough gems, but like, you know, also want to finish my story. And you know, I'm sat there like, I'm really happy for them, but at the same time, I would never want that for myself. And it's like, you know. I don't want to take that away from them. I think that they're doing a really great thing for them. I think that they're probably pretty happy and very, you know, cool with the whole situation. But I'm sat there like, I never want to have that because I work with kids and I mentioned before that, like, while they're fine, I'm, I'm not sitting there thinking, geez, I definitely want this 24-7 in my house all of the time, because that's going to be fun. Uh, I know I'm not going to be a good parent, because I'm not a particularly great disciplinarian teacher, you know? So I'm thinking, I'm just going to have this kid who's going to treat me like shit if I have a kid. And it's just like, I don't really want that. I don't want a wife. I don't want kids. And it's probably something to do with the way I was raised, where my perception of family is really fucked up, because the people I was raised by were fucking terrible people, who literally spent most of their time screaming and attacking each other for no real reason, other than they weren't happy, and who gives a shit how the kid grows up fucking depressed and fucked up for the rest of their life. I'm not happy. Wah, wah, wah. I'm not getting enough money for fucking free off of my husband. Wah, wah, wah. 
So, you know, and all of this misandrous garbage. And I just got to the point where I was like, you know what? That's what I associate family with. Shit. <laughs> that's what I associate it with. And I know that's not the case for everyone. But at the same time, I'm sitting there thinking, who boy, am I never having my own family? Because I feel like it's going to be a mirror fucking image of that because of who I am as a person. Can I just find this? Yeah. Modesty. By modesty. He was going to hide behind the shell. That's his whole thing. Why can't we do the spark shit yet? Have I not paid enough gold for sparks? Because he's here all the time. I'm also seeing if I can just find enough eggs in the world. Oh, these need uh, different things, some of them. But some of them just need enough eggs to be powered up, so I'm just uh, seeing if I can power up some extra arches as well. Ooh. Uh, yeah, so I was just kind of sat there like, I'm really happy for them, and then I was sat there, and like, you know, the irony is, like, let's talk to Hunter. Hunter. Hunter S. Thompson. Don't you have a, literally a fucking bow and arrow on your back? Yeah, I'm trying to press triangle, but it's activating your dumbass. Okay. I feel like Enchanted Tower sounds nice. It reminds me of, like, Dreamweavers of Spiral 1. Yeah, you know, and, uh, I, you know, the irony is, I, you do that review whenever there's a major life event in your friends' lives, and you think, oh, that's kind of crazy. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, planters. Okay. Sorry, I'm kind of just skipping dialogue because I'm just like, uh, yeah, I, I got it. It's not like you're missing great lore of the Spire universe. It's them just saying, yo, dog, do you just want to blow this up? And you're like, yeah, okay. Okay, the fourth one is where? Huh? No, 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 no. Don't, don't grow back. And, uh, I'm ruining people's gardening. Oh, Matt. Matt the dragon. Bye, Matt. That's good. Didn't get all the gems there, did I? No. It's good to collect these eggs. So I was end up having to go back and grind. <laughs> Oh. Oh, super flame, okay. Super flame. Yeah, so like, uh, the irony is, like, you know, whenever someone else has a great, important thing in their life happen, you review and you try and evaluate. I'm really happy with where I am. You know, I'm like, oh, I'm on the way to getting myself a motorbike. I'm still living in a way that I enjoy. You know what I mean? It's just that I'm perfectly happy. And it's just like, I don't feel any, like, sadness, and I don't feel any self-punishment or social pressure to actually get married and have kids, which is pretty sick for me, I feel like. <clears throat> don't know where these missing gems are, but that's okay. Uh, I'm going to stop in a minute. Uh, let's go talk to Thingy and unlock the bird. The burb. How he this guy keeps a job when he just rockets in her fireworks factory, but I'm willing to release him into your custody, provided you pay his outstanding fines. Free the penguin. What a suck of dub that is! It's a far, far better thing you do today, Spyro, than you have ever done. And, uh, well, so forth.
Sergeant Burr, 90068. Awaiting orders, sir. Um, I think you'll have to find your commanding officer for that. Hey, what are those things? These are the latest military hardware. DBX-9 rocket launchers, state of the art. So why did you use them to escape? Because, because I have limited ammo, and I wanted to conserve it. <laughs> 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 Money bags get wrecked on all that. That punk song. Yeah, I got a little trumpet for him. He's so cute. Ah, oh, yeah. I'll do this next time. Uh, I'll do that and I'll do one normal level and a few other things. Yeah, like I'm sat here still like acting like it's the 90s, downloading PS, uh, downloading my MP3s, my death metal MP3s onto my uh, computer so I can listen to them at work with my headphones, uh, playing Spyro, eating pizzas and like trying to get motorbikes and shit. And like, I couldn't be happier, <laughs> you know what I mean? That's what's so funny. Everyone's like, oh, isn't it about time? Well, you know, this attitude in China persisted. Isn't it about time you grew up and had a shit life? And it's like, you know how much trauma I associate with that? I don't see it as a positive thing at all. So no, I'm staying fucking how I am. I love it. And, you know, some people are like, eh, it's so sad. You're not doing this. It's like, I don't give a fuck, man. <laughs> like, you know. I'd rather be happy than be fucking conformist chicken shit the rest of my life, so. No offense, though, to people who actually want to do that and it's their choice to do it, because it's like in some of like, my friends' cases, they want to do that, and I'm happy for them, and that's the thing, right? You've got to find that balance. I'm not a kid-hating, crazy cat person nut job. I'm just, I don't want it for me. My friends want it. Good for them. I love to see their fucking kids grow up. That's great. I don't want it though. And I shouldn't be pressured to want it either, so. And no one is. That's the thing. All my British friends are getting married and having kids, and they're like, oh, you know, good for you. And the only shit I hear is from their wives that are not my friends. Like, I didn't grow up with them, they met them somewhere. And then they're like, so when are you getting married? I have friends who are single, and I'm like, Never. <laughs> like, you know, and that's like the conversation. Um, and I'm just like, well, good for you, buddy. I'm really happy for you. I literally am. Uh, just it ain't for me. And I mean, it's not about me, is it? So it's like, at the end of the day, it's my opinion for this doesn't that mean shit. I said I wanted to be the kid's godfather, though. Uh, <clears throat> mostly so I could teach him the ways of Satan, but as his, this guy's wife is super Christian, I can't see her being, well, not super, fairly Christian, I can't see her being chill with that, you know? Alright, I thought I saw some red gem down here. Oh, we got them all. I'm looking for gems that don't exist. Okay, I'm going to end this part now and stop my rant about how, as you gradually transition to 30, suddenly everyone decides that you don't have free will anymore, and you can't choose what to do, because it really is just isolated to China. But you've got to remember, China is kind of like Australia and New Zealand. They're about 30 years behind Europe in terms of their attitudes. Uh, they're still fairly semi-homophobic in places, kind of more traditional and patriarchy. And, you know, all of that shit. And it's just like, they don't like people who have alternative lifestyles so much. So there's all of that. But, yeah, you know, at the end of the day, it's my fucking life, as Bon Jovi said. I'm pretty sure he swore in that song. <laughs> Fun fact, It's My Life came out in 2000. And I thought it came out with his earlier shit, like um, Living on a Prayer. And it was actually like 20 years after that, you know? It's nuts, isn't it? Uh, anyway, time to carry on downloading Aura Noir and Dissection album albums for my uh, <laughs> for my uh, for listening to work and play Spyro. So, ciao for now. <laughs>